my name is Eni and welcome to my channel. So someone brought me a question and it it says using HTML create a table from the diagram below. So today I'm going to teach you how to create a table in HTML, okay? In the form of this diagram. Alright, so first what we do is we open notepad. Pretty amazing, right? Yes, notepad. Yes, to create a website we use notepad for beginners uh, so this is how it is done so even if you're a beginner don't worry I'll teach you how to do it step by step so you can get the understanding first these are the following tags we type this this tag which we normally call less than yes some people don't know how to type that so we press the shift key and press comma behind the M letter M on the keyboard. All right. Then we add this symbol, which is Shift plus one. And we type doc type doc type HTML. Okay. So we need to close the tag. So this is what we need. Then we press Enter. Make sure you close the tag by using this symbol. Then you type your HTML yes so i'll then come in the middle of this and press enter then arrange them so these are some of the basic codes you need to know you need to put them in your head so we write head okay then we close the head anytime you open a tag you need to close it close the head then in the middle of it i'll then write title after i'll show you the outcome title then we close the title okay. Type in first okay like this so in the middle of the title um uh, any the boss website any the boss website like this so we need to close the tag which we've already done all right so let me save the work and open it so i just write table so when typing table then add dot html then you save it so this is how it becomes on your desktop the icon changes into a browser a web browser this so i'm using microsoft edge so let's open it so this is the head of the page okay so any the boss website and this is the body okay so we are done with the head we are moving to the body which uh, the main designs will be okay or the main a uh, the web page itself all right so let me switch to notepad so we are done with the head let me leave two space so it shouldn't confuse you so let's add the body so body like this and make sure you close it body like that then in the middle of the body we want to uh, uh, give it a head okay you can't just go ahead and create and just say this is the table no we need to create a title for it which will be we leave a space and type h2 the h means head a 2 a 2 is a font size in html the smaller the number the bigger the letter and the bigger the uh, the number the smaller the letter so let's close it close it by typing h2 anytime you open a tag you need to close it then we type this is my table okay all right this is my let me save it and let's see how it becomes let me refresh it okay. so this is how it becomes this is my table okay let's add full stop to it and let's underline it so underline is 
u tag let me go to the end and close the u tag hope you understand let's save it again and let's see the magic so this is how it is now let's move to the table okay so before i create a table we are still in the body which you can see here okay so anything i do in the body will reflect here i hope you get it so uh, we want to add a table let's just write table table uh -huh. then close it table all right so in the table we have what we call table head and table body and we have table rows yeah that is the tag so each table has a row okay each table has a row so let's just write table row then let's close it like this so in the table row this is what we write in write our table head th make sure you close it th the first letter is what first name oh my god first name then you open the right table head again which is the other table head so it is the last name I will close the tag and the last one is table head the last one is inch right make sure you close the tag like this okay so let's see it and let's see our outcome so very open uh, the browser try to refresh it and this what happens okay yes this is how it will be later you add the lines i'll teach you how to add the lines so let's continue with the body with the table body okay so we come to the end of the table uh row okay it's in rows first row second row and third row so let's move to the second row which i'll leave two space the right table row close it okay you are doing it as the first how you did the first one so i'll come here and then write the first name is jill which is the first name oh sorry let me put it in a tag table body td okay now let's close it td yes this is head because uh, we are writing a table head every table has a head okay the title of the table huh. then we have table body which is the body of the table okay huh. so that is why this one is T D, which is table body and this one is th i hope you get it uh -huh. so let's move to the second one which is the last name T D, which is called smith then let's close the tag Let's open another tag. CD. His age is 50. Then let's close the tag. CD. So we are done with the second row. So you come to the end of this, then press enter. Enter. Let's move to the next row. Close the row. Alright. Then this will still be table body. So TD, yes, it's still a body. Uh, the first name is Eve. Eve. And let's close the tag. Any mistake you do, one mistake will, uh, will destroy the whole thing. So make sure you do it well. TD, Jackson. Then close the tag. 
the age is 94 so make sure I close the tag like that so let's save and run and let's see so this is how it is going to be then let's add another one which is the last one so that I can understand so table row we close the tag like this okay come here C D which is the table body the first name is John let's close the tag like that then the last name which is do let's close the tag td like that then the age cd the age is 80 and let's close the tag so yes we are done let's save it and this is how it it will become so what is left is the bodies the lines which will be drawn inside the table so what we do is we come here table and you can see i've closed it here okay and this is what is written in the table so we have written the table just add border border then at the end of the table to be add what but of course you want to create borders okay then save it then let's see the magic we run it this is how it will become okay so this is how we create a table in HTML. okay i hope you get it all right so next time we're looking at some past questions okay how to um solve some past questions uh, work past questions in ATML and other uh, uh, and other softwares as well, such as Q Basic, Access, Excel. Okay, I'm dealing with uh, the elective ICT students in SHS and diploma students who are writing ABC and GBC examinations. Okay. Yeah, so that is what I'll be doing in my page from now. All right, thank you. Yeah, I want that love to last ending. I'm loving what is happening. Then this watch that singing. Shine to 